Hi, um, we are VSA Fresh Reps 2021. Uh, my name is Lynn and I'm here with Whitney, Jason, Leo, and Kenny. We're going to be telling a Vietnamese ghost story. I hope you guys enjoy. After the war ended, many wives were waiting for their husbands to come home from fighting. One day, after many years, one of the soldiers returned to his wife and home on a small rural farm in Vietnam. The wife was understandably relieved and happy that her husband was alive and well. She ran up the road and as he was approaching, embraced him, crying tears of joy. But the husband, seemingly unmoved by her tears, only said, I'm at my door. His manner was a little strange and his voice seemed a little off, but he was her dear husband who just returned from the war when so many had died. She was so happy to have him back that she didn't care and prepared him a meal. The husband ate and immediately went to bed right after. He slept through the rest of the day and only woke at night to say to his wife, Again, the wife was still so overjoyed about having her husband back after a long absence that she complied. This continued the next day and the day after that. The husband would wake up, tell the wife to prepare him food, eat, and then go back to sleep the whole day. Days began to turn into weeks. The wife worked all day to maintain the farm, but as the couple was poor in the first place, and now all the husband did was eat and sleep, she was running out of food for them both. She noticed that her husband's voice sounded deeper, as if not his own, and he was not behaving like his usual self. The wife began to become frightened and desperate. She called upon the local Catholic priest for help. He came and observed the husband, finally saying to the wife, The wife screamed out in shock and fear, but the only thing to do was to exercise the spirit, or whatever it was inside her husband. The priest waited until nightfall, when the husband usually woke up to demand food. But instead of his wife there, stood the priest. The priest quickly performed the exorcism ritual and the husband fell to the ground, the body decomposing rapidly to nothing but dust. The husband was long dead. The spirit must have found his body and used it to live a semblance of a life. The wife was lucky it was not a malevolent spirit or demon that wanted to do her harm.